In this video, we are discussing data organization pattern overview. In some cases, we may have to transform our data from one interface to another interface. In those cases, this particular data organization design pattern can be used there. So, let us go for some further discussion on it. So, what is data organization pattern? For many organizations, the Hadoop and the MapReduce are the only solutions to analyze the large data set. So, we are having the Hadoop and the respective MapReduce which will be coming along with the Hadoop will be required to be used for the analyzing a large data set of the big data. So, so, so sometimes we need to transform our data from one interface to the another interface. So, it is uh, might be our requirement. So, for that purpose we should be using this data organization design pattern. So, whenever we are transforming our data from one interface to another interface, there is a very suitable design pattern to be used. We will see 5 different patterns here. So, under this category we are having 5 different patterns. So, structured to hierarchical patterns. So, one interface to another interface, here we are having this structured and here we are having the hierarchical pattern. Partitioning pattern, binning pattern, total order shorting pattern and the last one will be the shuffling pattern. We will be discussing all these patterns in the successive videos in this chapter. Please watch all of them and thanks for watching this.